Hi, my name is Heather. I recently had a visit from my air conditioning man, and I complained to him that I'm always getting sick. He suggested that I install an RGF Guardian Air unit, and he mentioned a sneeze machine, and I thought, what is a sneeze machine? So I researched it and found that RGF has developed a machine that can kill a sneeze within three feet. And they developed a sneeze machine to prove it. So I decided to trek on over there and see exactly what this is all about. So here I am at RGF, and what have I found? A whole think tank of scientists that have invented hundreds of environmental products. I'm here with Ron Fink, the president of RGF. So Ron, what the heck is a sneeze machine? Well, Heather, what your air conditioning man recommended to you was either our REMI unit or our PHI unit. Both of these units have the ability to kill almost any virus or bacteria that we know of. It's been tested on M1H1, Norwalk virus, it's used in all the cruise ships, military uses it, hospitals use it. It's used all over the world. How it works is it operates on creating hydroperoxides. It's kind of like misting the air with hydrogen peroxide, thereby setting up aggressive oxidizers into the room to kill viruses in midair. How this all came about was about 10 years ago, Sandia National Lab, which is the national lab that's responsible for uh, terrorist attacks, uh, was looking for a way to divert a terrorist attack on an airplane. For example, a terrorist could get on an airplane and aspirate a virus. Nobody would know what he was doing. Everybody on the plane would be exposed to the virus. They get off the plane, go in many different directions, and you have a pandemic. That virus would be all over the country in no time. So what they asked us to do was develop a method in the HVAC system, the air conditioning system, that would kill a virus on contact so that the pandemic would be limited. The problem with that was, and we pointed out to them that, and we happened to be sitting around a round table, and I said, well, what good would that do? If the unit was in the HVAC, in the air conditioning, what would matter if, if it went down there and was killed? The problem is, for example, if I sneeze right now, and I sneeze at you, or in that meeting, I said, if I sneeze at this table, you all have been exposed. And whether it goes down to the HVAC system and gets killed and comes back dead is immaterial. You've already been exposed. So what we needed to do was to have aggressive oxidizers or aggressive advanced oxidizers into the air that would kill the virus as soon as it comes out. So we had that. We have a unit that emits hydroperoxides. We told them that, and they said, this is great. This is fantastic. You can actually do that. Yes. And they said, well, we have to prove it. We have to validate it. And that's how we came up with the sneeze machine. You can't validate something like a sneeze when no two people sneeze alike. We took and we looked at the situation and we said, okay, what is a sneeze? How is it made up of? Well, the sneeze comes out at about 100 miles an hour. When you would spell a sneeze, you would spell the volume of one lung. You have two lungs, but only one lung comes out in a sneeze. So we took the average lung and we built a chamber, which you can see in the back. That's a one lung chamber. And you also expel about half a gram of fluid. So we made it adjustable so we could time the sneeze. We could expel half a gram of fluid. And we have one lung and we could control the speed. So we developed it and what we are set up for today is about 100 miles an hour, half a gram of fluid and one lung expulsion. You want to see how it works? Please. Oh, gee, thanks. Oh, I'm sorry. For more information about the sneeze machine or any of our 500 environmental products, log on to rgf.com.